All right, I'm going to show everyone how to make a repair to a crack in a door. We just made this amazing door, and we're getting ready to ship it out, and I noticed there's a hairline crack in the wood. And instead of freaking out, what we did was we thought about it carefully and discovered that we have this product in our shop called FastCap 2P10. We've got a 2P10 adhesive gel in this can right here. And we've also got a 2P10 solo activator. Now this without the activator is useless. I'm going to show you what we did. First we took some blue painter's tape and we taped off the area around the crack. The crack is about four inches long right along this joint right here. I'm going to spread that apart. You can kind of see the crack. There's two of them actually. So we're going to take this 2P10 adhesive gel. We're going to open up the crack just a little bit, kind of spread this in there best we can and get started. We're going to take an auto body spreader, Bondo, they use this for Bondo, and we're just going to work it into the joint back and forth. Try to push as much as you can into that joint. Now this will not set up by itself right away. It needs the activator to set up. So I just take my time, get it in both of those little cracks as good as we can. This stands up really nice too. It's going to be really hard and really uh, sandable. So once I get most of the excess off, I'm going to set that spatula aside. I'm going to take the this 2P10 activator, shake it up real good, and I'm going to spray it right on the piece. And that's going to immediately activate it, probably within like less than five seconds, this is going to be a uh, structurally solid joint. So I'm going to spray it now and test it. Okay, Just spray it, quick, quick sprays, and that is going to be set up in no time. I'm going to squeeze the crack together just so it cures better. And uh, literally as I'm speaking, it's uh, structurally sound. That stuff is absolutely amazing. So we've got the 2P10 gel. Comes in a big, big jar like this. It's actually $40. Can you believe that? And this activator, 10 bucks. So for 50 bucks, I just saved having to make a $300 door. It took me about 10 minutes. Tomorrow I will sand off the excess around the joint, and this door will be ready to go. So that's it.